Hello, welcome to how to solve this very nice square root math simplification problem. Square root of 81 squared plus 49 squared plus 2 to the power 16 divided by 2. This expression can be written as square root of this 81 can be written as 9 squared whole to the power this power 2 plus this 49 squared can be written as 7 squared whole to the power 2 plus this 2 to the power 16 can be written as 2 to the power 4 times 4 divided by 2 next square root of by using this power rule a to the power m whole to the power n is equal to a to the power m times n. This uh, 9 squared whole to the power 2 will become 9 to the power 2 times 2 plus this uh, 7 squared whole to the power 2 will become 7 to the power 2 times 2 plus this uh, 2 to the power 4 times 4 can be written as uh, 2 to the power 4 whole to the power 4 divided by 2. Next square root of now this uh, 9 to the power 2 times 2 will become 9 to the power 4 plus this uh, 7 to the power 2 times 2 will become 7 to the power 4 plus uh, this uh, 2 to the power 4 is 16 whole to the power this power 4 divided by 2. Now we suppose that let a is equal to 9 and b is equal to 7. Then this a plus b will be equal to 16 and we substitute a b and a plus b then this expression will become square root of a to the power 4 plus b to the power 4 plus a plus b whole to the power 4 divided by 2. Now by using this algebraic identity a plus b whole to the power 4 is equal to a to the power 4 plus 4 times a cubed b plus 6 times a squared b squared plus 4 times a b cubed plus b to the power 4. This expression will become square root of first we write this uh, a to the power 4 and this b to the power 4 a to the power 4 plus uh, b to the power 4 now in place of this uh, a plus b whole to the power 4 we write this expression a to the power 4 plus uh, 4 times a cubed b plus 6 times a squared b squared plus 4 times a b cubed plus b to the power 4 divided by 2. Next square root of this 1 a to the power 4 plus this 1 a to the power 4 it become 2 times a to the power 4 and this uh, 1 b to the power 4 plus uh, this 1 b to the power 4 will become plus uh, 2 times b to the power 4. Then we write this uh, 6a squared b squared plus 6a squared b squared and this uh, plus uh, 4 times a cubed b plus uh, 4 times a cubed b and this uh, 4 times a b cubed plus uh, 
4 times a b cubed divided by 2 next square root of now from this expression in the numerator we can factor out 2 2 as common factor and in bracket left a to the power 4 plus b to the power 4 plus 3 times a squared b squared plus 2 times a cubed b plus 2 times a b cubed divided by 2. Now, this 2 will be cancelled out with this 2 and here we are left with square root of a to the power 4 plus b to the power 4 plus 3 times a squared b squared plus 2 a cubed b plus 2 a b cubed. Next square root of now this a to the power 4 can be written as a squared whole squared plus this b to the power 4 can be written as b squared whole squared plus this uh, 3 a squared b squared can be written as 2 a squared b squared plus 1 a squared b squared plus this 2 a cubed b plus 2 uh, a b cubed next square root of now by using this uh, algebraic identity x squared plus uh, y squared plus uh, 2xy is equal to x plus y whole squared. This expression a squared whole squared plus uh, b squared whole squared plus uh, 2a squared b squared will become square root of a squared plus uh, b squared whole squared plus this uh, a squared b squared can be written as a times b whole squared plus uh, from these two terms uh, we can factor out 2 a b 2 a b as common factor and in bracket left uh, a squared plus uh, b squared x square root of now this expression can be rewritten as a squared plus b squared whole squared plus a b whole squared plus two times this a squared plus b squared times this a b a b now in this expression this uh, a squared plus b squared is as x in this a b is as y in this is 2 x y so by using this uh, algebraic identity x squared plus y squared plus 2 x y is equal to x plus y whole squared this expression will become square root of a squared plus b squared plus a times b whole squared. Now this square will be cancelled out with this square root and here we are left with a squared plus b squared plus a times b. Now recall that we have supposed we have supposed that a is equal to 9 and b is equal to 7. We have supposed that a is equal to 9 and b is equal to 7. So this expression will become 9 squared plus 7 squared plus 9 times 7. 
next this uh, 9 squared is 81 plus this 7 squared is 49 plus uh, this uh, 9 times 7 is 63 and this 81 plus 49 plus 63 is equal to 193. So, this is the simplest form, this is the final answer of this problem.